Coco is Ghana's second leading foreign exchange earner, accounting for about 30% of all revenue and 70% of all agricultural exports. Ghana has been contributing 20% to the global supply of cocoa. Productivity in the sector has not been the best since 2010. Government interventions of input subsidy and artificial pollination strategies have been helpful, but experts are encouraging the use of hybrid seeds for improved yields. When farmers plant their seedlings, they have most of them dying. So we started distributing our seedlings in 2015 to these coca, coca life farmers. The feedback we got from the farmers was that the survival rate that the farmers are having on field is 95%. We survey the 60% that they were getting with the traditional seedlings. Those who planted our seedlings in 2015 started seeing their first pod in 2017. The Cocoa Life program by Mondelez affords cocoa farmers hybrid seeds from Tree Global. 35,000 farmers in cocoa growing areas across the country received 55,000 seedlings, which has boosted production immensely. Tree Global has been contracted to produce quality and innovative seedlings for farmers in the Cocoa Life communities at their central nursery station in Tafo in the eastern region to ensure high yields. The hybrid Tetekoshi cocoa seedlings produced from the seed production division of the Ghana Cocoa Board are nest in plastic pots designed to protect the taproot of the seedlings instead of the usual polythene to boost production. Cocoa Board has, through scientific research, has established the number of shade trees that should be planted per hectare in a cocoa farm. So we follow that. So apart from the cocoa that the farmers receive, they also receive uh, um, economic trees. The country lead for Mondelez International, Yapipra Amikoji, wants government to assist farmers with hybrid seeds in order to increase productivity. There's a lot of work for us to do and a lot to see that we have funding to, to be able to support Tree Global, to have bigger nurseries, not here alone in Tafu, maybe locate them Brongahafu, Western Region, and also providing sustainable income because if a farmer can harvest from three years, then the farmer will be getting more income.